heartaches for the many loved ones Vincent Jackson leaves behind, from his wife and children to the Buccaneers nation that adored him. Hillsborough County Sheriff Chad Cronister said in the statement, Mr. Jackson was a devoted man who put his family and community above everything else. Football aside, he touched countless lives through his Jackson in Action 83 Foundation. We shared a passion for supporting military families, and three years ago, Jackson was even made an honorary deputy by the Hillsborough County Sheriff's Office to recognize his dedication to the community. He will be sorely missed by not only football fans across the country, but also the people here in Hillsborough County who reap the benefits of his generous contributions. Jackson was one of the top wide receivers in the NFL throughout his career, finishing with 540 catches for 9,080 yards and 57 touchdowns. He topped 1,000 yards in six different seasons and earned three Pro Bowl selections, leading the NFL with 19.2 yards per catch in 2012. Jackson led all wide receivers in yards per catch from 2005 to 2016. We are shocked and deeply saddened by news of Vincent Jackson's sudden passing, the Chargers said in a statement. Vincent was a fan favorite not only for his Pro Bowl play on the field but for the impact he made on the community off of it. The work he has done on behalf of military families through his foundation in the years since his retirement has been an inspiration to all of us. We simply cannot believe he's gone, and our hearts go out to his wife, Lindsay, their children, his parents, former teammates and everyone whose lives were touched by having known Vincent. During his five seasons with our franchise, Vincent was a consummate professional, who took a great deal of pride in his performance on and off the football field. Buccaneers co-owner Brian Glazer noted in his statement, Vincent was a dedicated father, husband, businessman and philanthropist who made a deep impact on our community through his unyielding advocacy for military families. Supported by the Jackson in Action 83 Foundation. He was a three-time Pro Bowl selection for his accomplishments on the field. But his greatest achievements as a Buccaneer were the four consecutive nominations he earned as our Walter Payton Man of the Year. Our deepest condolences go out to his wife, Lindsay, and the entire Jackson family. Jackson is fourth on the Buccaneers' all-time receiving yards list at 4,326 and his 68.7 receiving yards per game are third in franchise history. Jackson owns the Buccaneers' record for receiving yards in a game and longest reception in a game. He's 10th on the Chargers' all-time receiving yards list with 4,754 and tied for 8th in touchdowns with 37. His 17.5 yards per catcher third in franchise history amongst players with more than 250 receptions. A second-round pick in the 2005 NFL Draft out of Northern Colorado, Jackson was the school's all-time leader in receptions receiving yards, kick return yards, punt return yards, and receiving touchdowns. Jackson retired from the NFL in 2018.